My name is Lewis Thompson. This is my war story. It was around 1917. We were deployed in a no man's land on the Sinai Peninsula. It was almost as if they put us there because they knew our bodies would soon be devoured by the sand. Dead men in a dead space. As a young lad I went hunting with my father. I could handle a rifle, but I couldn't handle the killing in war. There is a difference between killing a deer for food and killing a man for... For what? Seeing those clouds of blood in my scoop, it was surreal and terrifying. Well, we have taken objective done. at first, by the end of the battle, it almost felt satisfying, rewarding, because it meant I would get to live a little longer. The sun was coarse and rough, and it got everywhere. The big storm got me separated from my company. I was on my own. Every footstep I heard got my heart to rush, but my 1911 never failed me. It was a present from my cousin Richard, who moved to New York. But at some point, I ran out of ammo. By then, I felt no more mercy for my enemies. I would strike them with my shovel or impale them with my bayonet. I, I was deaf to the last screams. I managed to get out of the city somehow, looking for one of our outposts. The heat nearly drove me insane. I would have croaked out there if it weren't for my friend Jamie. He wouldn't rest until he found me. And he did. We regrouped with our company soon. There was only a few dozen of us left. We have taken objective Charlie. But seeing the Union Jack rise above my head gave me the hope, certainty, that I would get back home alive. And I did. Still, to this day, I am not sure if it was for the better.